at some point uh, I thought of the the matter and the particles and energy clusters in a bit different way or a way different way than I always thought in school even these days the kids don't really get the correct answer about what matter and how your reality is being built and they go by the uh, old Newtonian theories and they touch a bit of Einstein relativity theories just to make it sound cool or to make it level of uh, reality and I thought about that and I, I uh, kind of rediscovered, reinvented the wheel, re rediscovered that the matter is actually a field that is made out of energy clusters. I don't know how they call it in the new science, new quantum theories, because I don't read those, but the way I figured it is like a bunch of condensed or concentrated parts of the energy that form sort of a cluster and have uh, specific properties that according to those properties like the frequency of vibration, the uh, density of those clusters, uh, which to a turn assign that cluster of energy certain type of forces and um, the direction of movement and all sort of stuff that energy field is being created and the way we have the uh, senses tells me that we are built to see a certain part of this reality so the reality is much larger infinitely large it would be uh, energies beside the energy fields that we live in that we are made of could be energy completely different that uh, form different realms different uh, realities and say that but what I want to demonstrate here uh, the clusters too if you look at these snowflakes they move all over the place they look like uh, they float in soup to a fluid which is the air and they don't have a clear direction why not because uh, being uh, so tiny so small they can be pushed around by other energy clusters that make the air particles so this wind this uh, air current is moving this snowflake They are still uh, independent, but what, do, what happens if you concentrate this master of energy into a, a confined surface like this thing? Now you have the more so solid appearing material, the way we sense it, by our senses, by our senses, appears solid. using uh, snowflakes because it's uh, easy to understand for the kids level without getting into theories and formulas and uh, mathematics which I uh, don't have clues about but this cluster of energy which some uh, physicians they call them photons some people think that they are made out of light but they don't go deeper into that. Why? Because probably they just copy the concept and they pass it on to others. Uh, light is made out of the same type of energy. And you can build anything you want, not you, but uh, the creators can build anything they want with that type of uh, field. And those type of clusters is like uh, using pieces of software, pieces of by, uh, bits in a computer to build a, a program that in turn is built